Yo, hey YouTube, this is Big Good Music Recordings and Production LLC. Today we're going to discuss how to take your, your programs and layer your sounds. Now as you know, a program contains all your sounds, all your kits, and your hi-hats. Once you load up your sounds, you can layer those sounds create a whole different type of sound um, as you see I got my own custom program loaded up it's the be good rap kit 2 program and I got like all the rap kits all pretty much all these sounds I made um, pertaining to rap and hip-hop um, basically I got a lot of layered sounds and I'm gonna show you how to do that you know, because some of these factory sounds, they're good, but in order to make your, your music really stand out, you're going to have to do some tweaking and create your own sounds. Um, right now, <clears throat> as you can see, I'm on a, the main menu. And if you got your NPC loaded up, you, will, you can tell I'm on the menu, which is right here, main menu. Um... To get to the, <coughs> to start switching sounds and layering them, we'll go to the program edit, the program edit menu, because you're editing a program, that's what your songs are, so it's self-explanatory. Right now I'm starting off with one sound, which is my Be Good Hip Hop Kit. This is actually two sounds that I had. Eventually, I end up layering and I end up re resampling. So, this is what it sounds like. It's an 808 and a 909 combined, but this is one sound. Now, if you want to create <coughs> another sound, if you want to layer the sound to give it a different flavor, all you have to do is go to layer 2 and click the triangle box and this this contains all your sound in the, in the selected program that you're using so I'm gonna choose let's go with percussion 20 let's go with 12 okay that sounds better percussion 12 and as you can see this is one sound That's one that's one sound you know and we can also manipulate this some more you can add your own personal effects you can either add the NPC effects or you can add you know your other effects from your third party plug your plugins but it has to be scanned first for them to show up. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, you need to check out my plug-in video that I did a while back. I think it was like two weeks ago. So I'm finna add a delay effect to it. Let's see how it sounds. And then you can add a phaser. I'm gonna add a phaser to see how that sounds. And that's one sound. You can add up to four sound. You can add up to four effects and layer up to four sounds on one sound. You know, see, this is only two layers I have. You know, I can you know do three and select another one. I don't really hear a difference. You can let's go with. Uh, And that's one sound. That's one sound. You can also resample a sound um, if you would like. So you can uh, layer it even more. Um, let's check out how it sounds. I 
Okay, as 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 you can tell, that's one sound. You know what I'm saying? This is one sound because it's on A pad A13. So this is, I can also layer the clap if I wanted to. Uh, let's go with the. You can just let's go with you can also add an effect to that on your second song. I mean on your second pad song. Just hit this. Let's go to auto walk. Add a delay to that. And there you have it. You can lay, layer, you can layer four sounds per sound, per pad, pretty much. Um, I'm going to make this a four part series so I can really get in depth but I just wanted to show you guys the basics because once you understand the basic there's like endless possibilities that you can do with this so let's let's play around with it and see how this sounds So let's do a rig crap. Okay, you see I'm on the main main page. To get to your <clears throat> to layer your sounds, you're gonna go up to the program edit window because you're editing a program and that's what your sounds are. It's nothing but programs of sound. So you will go to the program edit and then right here you'll go, you'll select first you'll select your pad, whatever pad you want. As you can tell, you can just hi highlight it right here. See that's A13, A12, A11, or you can press the hardware to navigate to your pad. See that's A A6. So you can do that either way, you know. But the key is, you know, once you get there, you see your layer, your layer one will always be the sound you're starting off with, and your layer two, three, four will be the sound that you want to layer that sound of. And remember, you can always go to here to the, the effects and add up to four effects. All you have to do is cut this on. You can just click that right there. And it'll turn on for you. So, please subscribe, rate the video, comment, and uh, enjoy your MPC. This is going to be probably, a, this is going to be about like a four-part series on this. And this is going to be labeled program basic editing so please stay tuned and enjoy your MPC renaissance you gotta get it you gotta get it